Oh, <laughs> that was an expensive mistake. Bye for now, Doreen. So we drove till we dropped last night. We stayed in a really random place called Bad Farts, which is a great name for a place. And this morning we got up, had a little look at the nice pier and set off for Hirchels. And here we are in yeah. Hirchels, which is, I think, near enough to the most northern part of Denmark. And we're going to be getting a ferry from Hirchels to the south of Norway this afternoon. So we've just had some lunch. We're just going to spend an hour enjoying the beach, maybe getting the water. And then head off to the ferry? Yeah, let's go. I like your dress. Thank you. Yeah, where'd you get that from? ASOS. ASOS, lovely. Thank you. Orange suture. Do you think orange suture? <laughs> Let us know below. On the list of needed upgrades is the grey tank situation. Not ideal. Really quick dunk in the sea before we go. Let's do it! You're looking very French. Thank you. Can you use some soup? And guess what? Hey sauce! <laughs> <laughs> Probably my fault when I booked it. So. <laughs> okay, fab. 109 euros. Ouch. That's an expensive mistake. Is that 109 euros or. <laughs> <laughs> oh that was an expensive mistake. I didn't put uh, the van as high as it actually is. And the ferry was about 150 euros and I just had to pay an extra 109 Aww. to adjust the height. Oh. At least we're going to cheap country. <laughs> the ferry! Hello. Thank you for ringing and have a safe journey. Okay, love you lots. Oh, thank you. Bye. Bye for now, Doreen. You be good. <laughs> there was a distinct moodiness in the element as we left Denmark. You could feel the power of Scandinavia in the rain, the wind and the sea. The ferry was fast. I have never seen or felt an engine on a boat as powerful as this. It was churning through the turbulent North Sea with ease. We had hatched this plan to come to Norway long ago and only now was it hitting us that the Norse trolls and fjords were fast approaching on the horizon. Can I have some food? What have we got? 
I've got vegan red curry. You got yourself a beer as well, did you? No, this is yours. Oh, thank you. This was five pounds fifty for a Carlsberg. How much is your food? Twelve pounds. You can get two beers for that. The landscape was instantly more rugged and craggy in contrast to the smooth North Danish shoreline and we could not wait to get out and about and explore Norway. That handbrake was um, <laughs> on. <laughs> this is carnage. <laughs> Hi Norway, you're very soggy. <laughs> I love Norwegian, it's so stink-soggy. <laughs> I think that's the end of the log for you. Did the logs just then um, tip in the water? So, literally been in Denmark about 20 minutes. Found our park up already, thanks to Park for Night. And literally 20 minutes from the ferry port, we have a waterfall, we have a lake, we have a stream, we've seen fish jumping out of the stream, and we have this really crazy log flume which you can hike on, which I'm currently on. Like, what the hell, Norway? You're setting your expectations quite high, this is what I got in the first 20 minutes. It's gonna be great! A bit drizzly so we think tomorrow we're gonna hike this log flume all the way to the top it's actually a little bit scary it feels a little bit spongy on the foot but quite enjoying it at the same time so yeah it's not to rain so we're gonna head back inside make some food and might even stick a film on on the projector who knows let's see The world's biggest yawn. And that's a wrap. That's a wrap. For today. <laughs> Parked up somewhere very beautiful and I am ready to sleep. The sun hasn't even properly set though. It's half 11. <laughs> gone, And it's like constant blue hour at the moment. It's, it's really Like light. that time after golden hour where everything just goes a weird dark blue hue. And Is it twilight? Is that what that's called? I don't know, I call it blue hour, but <laughs> it's dead moody outside and pretty cool. Good job we've got like blackout blinds and curtains that you put up to black out most of the lights. Yeah. Uh, I do have my eye mask too. Yeah, tomorrow we've got a very fun day. We're hopefully going to be hiking up this log flume, which... Ooh. Did you guys know what a log flume was except for the roller coaster? <sighs> we didn't <laughs> until we saw the log flume with a lake underneath it and we're like, yeah. oh, was that actually what it was? I'm but um, <laughs> if you've managed to watch this far, well done. Just so we know you watched it all this way, can you let us know what your favourite pizza topping is in the comments below, please? Paloma's is a bit weird. She likes, get this, she likes pineapple with olives and that's it. <laughs> it's a really good pizza. Try it. <laughs> I don't get it. And if you have watched this far, please leave a like. It really helps us <laughs> and our 84 followers. And you might help us get a couple more followers in one day. Who knows? Maybe. We could have like 112 maybe. <laughs> so yeah, thanks again and see, see you on tomorrow. the flip side. <laughs> bye bye. That's what I mean by blue hour. You dig? You dig? Uh -huh. They dig.